Hey everybody, it's Michael again with Cooking with Anarchy Tutorials and today I'm going to show you another trick uh, that you can do in iTunes. Um, this is going to be for these instances where you have um, uh, multiple covers in your cover flow for the same album. So in other words, I got these uh, first four right here which are Stone Free, a tribute to Jimi Hendrix, uh, various artists, and then the, after the next one, it's the same album but it says various on there instead so it hasn't really combined them. Um, so all you have to do is uh, you're going to highlight each one of these, okay? You're going you're gonna to choose each one of them. So the way you choose them all is to click on one of them and then hold down the uh, shift key. This is for PC. I'm not sure how to do it for Apple. I'm sorry, but um, hold down the shift key and then go to the very last one down here and you'll be able to highlight all of them right there if you click that. So um, again, that's left click, hold down the shift button, and then left click the last one right there. Okay, and then let go of the shift button. Once you get them all highlighted like that, you right click it and click on get info. You're gonna get this warning right here. Are you sure you wanna edit information for multiple items? Yes. And you have to change two things here. You have to change, you have to uh, check on the album right here, the album name, and then uh, check on the album artist. And I usually fill this in with various artists, something like that, or whatever. If this were all Jimi Hendrix, I would put Jimi Hendrix in there. Okay, and then you click OK. And it takes a moment. And it's updating them all. And now, as you can see, they're all one album right there. So we just kind of eliminated some clutter. Um, as a little bonus, I'm also going to show you how to get album covers. Uh, as you can see, this one right here doesn't have an album cover on it. There's a really cool website um, called um, allcdcovers.com, which I found today, which is uh, pretty cool. Um, and you're just going to scroll down to the bottom and you're going to search all CD covers and I'm going to search stone free. And let's see if they have it in here. They've been having like all of the album covers. Download Jimi Hendrix. Are you experienced? No, that's not it. Let's let's search for Stone Free, um, Jimi Hendrix. Uh, what's the name of the album? Tribute. Search that. Jimi Hendrix tribute right there. Looks like it's going to be this one. Stone Free, I'm going to click on that one right there. And uh, I know for a fact this is the CD right here, so I'm going to click on that, the front part. And if you scroll down, you can click on Download right here. And then it's going to show you, once it comes up, my, sorry, my internet connection is a little slow right now for some reason. Here's the album cover coming up. And I'm going to right click the album cover, save image as, and I'm going to put in this music folder right here. And again, this is this is really just for those instances where um, right click um, get album artwork doesn't work. There are instances where that works from time to time, but uh, I've, I've found that uh, more um, often it doesn't work than does work. So um, now that we have the album cover, I'm going to right click and go to get info. Actually, I'm sorry. I'm going to highlight all of them again by left clicking the first one, holding on the shift key, left click the last one, right click, get info. Are you sure you want to edit information for multiple items? Yes. And then the artwork area right here, click on that. And then double click that area right there, that box right here. Where it says artwork, I'll do it again. Double click right here in this in this box, and then your search comes up, and it's Stone Free, a tribute to Jimi Hendrix. Open and OK. And now all of them have the album cover, and they're all on the same album. So that's it. Um, hope this is helpful. Sorry if I've been if I was a little sputtering and everything throughout some of it, but I um, uh, hope you found it helpful. Um, please, please, please subscribe if you like this uh, tutorial. I'm going to be making more in the future, 
Um, and uh, that's about it. Have yourself a great weekend, everybody. Thanks. <laughs>